The cockroach you are looking at is still alive. Even with its head chopped off. But just how long can a cockroach survive without its head? Hi, welcome to Mytho Fact Channel. In this video, you will learn why cockroaches can survive without their head, and the maximum number of days they can survive in that state. So why can a cockroach survive without its head? There are two main reasons for that. Firstly, cockroaches don't bleed much. Unlike humans, cockroaches have an open circulatory system. This is a system for distributing blood through their bodies, that doesn't depend on a closed network of arteries, and veins. Their blood doesn't pump under pressure like ours. But just sort of sloshes around, making its way into the cockroach's tissues. The great thing about this system is that, if you're someday going to be headless, when a major wound occurs, blood doesn't suddenly get forced out. For a cockroach that loses its head, the blood just clots at the neck. The cockroach will have a nasty scab for sure, where its head used to be, but it won't die from loss of blood. Secondly, unlike humans, cockroaches don't breath through a nose or their mouth. Instead, they breathe through small holes in their bodies, called spiracles, that don't need a brain to direct them. No nose. No mouth. And no need for a brain to regulate your breathing means, that you can breathe all you want to without a head. However, a cockroach without a head, is probably going to die, from being unable to eat. And well before that, it's going to die from thirst. A headless cockroach, has no mouth to drink, or eat with. And will be dead from dehydration in less than a week. Which brings the total day count from the moment, it loses its head. To the moment it loses its life, to somewhere around 7 days or less. 